case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in 2005 the united states court of appeals for the eighth circuit heard the case of davidson and associates v young which focused on the digital millennium copyright act dmca and its exception for reverse engineering to achieve interoperability. Blizzard Entertainment and Vivendi sued Combs, Crittenden, Young, and Internet Gateway for violating their software end-user license, terms of usage agreements, and for copyright infringement. The defendants created an emulator that allowed unauthorized access to Battle.net features without a valid CD key, leading to unauthorized copies of Blizzard games being played on their servers. The district court originally ruled in favor of Blizzard and Vivendi stating that the appellants violated the anti-circumvention and anti-trafficking provisions of the DMCA. The appellants appealed, arguing that the DMCA's exception for achieving interoperability of computer programs through reverse engineering should apply to their actions. However, the Court of Appeals upheld the District Court's decision, stating that the appellants' actions constituted infringement and that they failed to establish a genuine issue of material fact regarding the applicability of the interoperability exception. Thus, summary judgment was correctly granted in favor of Blizzard and Vivendi for the anti-circumvention and anti-trafficking violations, as well as on the interoperability exception. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.